It's time together around the table with our friend Jolene Ketzenberger. She always has the best, latest local dining news. Jolene, you love when you're How are you, Jolene? Thank yeah. you. I'm well, thank you. You have a good weekend? Had a good weekend, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, good, relaxing, productive, oh, fun. It's very nice. Yes. yes. Well, and it's a good time to go out to eat on a weekend. Exactly. Make sure you get around. To I find myself too. going back and looking at your segments <laughs> on a weekend because I'm like, where did Jolene say? Yeah, yeah seriously. Well, I just did that last night with Lauren because we're talking about <laughs> yeah, her birthday okay. dinner. She's Aww. like, what did Jolene recommend? I was like, oh, that's awesome. I yeah. love that. Well, uh, new things happening all the time. So, um, in the Meridian Kessler neighborhood, New York Gourmet Deli has opened oh, at nice. 38th and oh, right, very close, 38th and Ruckel, which is very close to 38th and Central. Um, so that it's a former Roslyn, you can kind of tell. Yeah. Uh, so it's a it's a good little deli, uh, fresh meats, burgers. I um, just stopped in there last week, and they just opened. Um, so that's nice and new. There's also a location on the east side, I believe. Okay, cool. Nice. So yeah, so nice little little deli there that has open. That's fun. Um, I was all over town this week. So, this, so then also down in the Bargersville area, uh, Fusion Fish and Loaves, huh. which is um, oh, tacos and burritos, but also fish and chips. Okay. Right? So it really is a fusion restaurant. So that's uh, in Bargersville um, near Antilogy Restaurant and in a Kroger, Kroger shopping spot on 135. Bargersville's kind of blowing up. I, know, I got some yeah. friends who live down there and they right? love it down there. Lots, yeah. happening. Mm -hmm. Lots yeah. happening in Bargersville. And then um, on the northeast side, I had to see how we're coming along with A-Zip Pizza. So if you're familiar with that, that's in Bloomington as well. It launched in Evansville, I think, maybe in 2014. Ten locations wow. right now, right around ten. And another one, obviously, coming there at the Pyramids nice. on North Michigan Road. I respect a restaurant whose name is a palindrome. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, that great. It's perfect. I saw that immediately. I'm like, oh. You see what they did That's there. Perfect. I'm your target demo. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. Azip. All right. Azip. That's then, cool. Uh, in Franklin, um, Haberdasher Artisan Distillery. Isn't that cute? Ooh, that very, classy. very classy. Nice. Very classy. So that has opened in Franklin in the Garment Center and the Garment Factory Event Center. Okay. Um, I think it's a, they say that it's the first active distillery in Franklin since the Civil War. Really? Oh, wow. So, oh, that's cool. So very nice. Special in whiskeys and gins, actually. That's a so great I would, logo. I would like to try that gin. Mm. All right. Yeah, I, I would honestly, I would try it based on the logo. <laughs> Me too. Or just, I just want a yeah. bottle That's with great. that logo Isn't on that it. For perfect. Decoration. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, on the coffee and the coffee scene, so Dry Bones Mud House, which um, was uh, has been on South Meridian Street, 525 South Meridian, in the Union Building. So that is closing as of tomorrow. Okay. And but they are reopening. Um, as a brew and barbecue cafe in, huh. in New Palestine. A barbecue. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of yeah. like that. That's cool. Uh, so with Smoke and Barrel uh, Barbecue, they'll be opening in New Palestine on Main Street. Nice. So New Pal gets you know, coffee and barbecue. We just met um, a, a lady from, um, Kelly is her name. Uh, yeah. You remember Tessa's mom's friend? Yes, yeah, she's from right. New Pal. <laughs> yeah. New Pal's cool. It's like still rural enough, it but it, it's, it's, it's kind of on the come up and, here and, and there. Exactly. And they're very close to Indy. So. Yeah. Yes. So, yeah. Well, that's what makes your segment so great is because you do research <laughs> all do. over the viewing I, do. I honestly don't know how you do it all. Like you, you cover everywhere in like a week. Well, I try. Yeah, I love I it. I think how it's can so people cool. follow along with you so uh, that they can always find the latest oh, well, they news? Can, they can find me on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, follow along with Culinary Crossroads where we put the restaurant news as well. Fun. So, so there we go. Great times. I like your, your spooky t-shirt oh, too. No, time of year. So I wear, wear it once fun. a year. Tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Great. Eat, drink, and be scary. Perfect. Culinarycrossroads.org is where you can connect more with Jolene and give her a follow on social too. Thanks, Jolene. Thank you. Come up next, we're going to tell you about some fitness classes around India that are dedicated to pre and postnatal workouts. Our friends from the City Moms and Reforming Indy are joining us when we come back. See you soon. Let's get into physical. Let me <laughs>